So now we're going to uh, be looking at a seated guard versus a kneeling opponent and trying to go to single legs. Uh, so we might find that you know, if our opponent is defending this position well uh, and we're not able to get any kind of meaningful connection here, we can try to get their legs exposed and attach to the legs for a single leg X position. So um, if that's the direction we want to go. You can see how Mark's legs are essentially hidden. So the, the legs are not a target for us here or a direct target. We're going to have to manipulate our opponent's body to expose the legs because his weight is locking his legs down as legs are folded underneath him. Okay. So in order for the legs to get exposed, we need to get one of his knees or both of his knees to come off the mat. We need to release the, the weight from that leg so we can try to expose it. So initially we can just try to rock our opponent forward. Okay, so we're not really um, necessarily trying to sweep our opponent and draw out a, a leg as a post. We're just trying to pull our opponent's weight, you know, to pull their butt off their heels okay, so that we can uh, find the legs. Oftentimes this will be um, connected with attacks on the upper body as well because when we pull them forward, they might reach their arms where we can attack their arm or fight shoulder clamp techniques. Okay. But here we're going to look to essentially make double underhooks. So I'm going to try to get inside on both of my, opponent, my opponent's arms. And we're going to kind of try to lift them up the way you'd lift up a baby. Yeah, it's a, a, one of the strongest lifting platforms, the, the platforms that we have to lift uh, our opponent, the way the, the shapes connect. Like think about what an underhook is doing, okay, for example. So I'm going to try to open my opponent's elbows by controlling the line of his knuckles and rotating that out. This is something that we teach a lot of Marcellos to find underhooks, okay, both from top and bottom position. So I'm going to look to expose that space. And I'm going to come uh, inside here with my arms. Here I can start to just kind of lift my opponent up. At the same time, I'm going to round my back, okay, scoop my butt inside, and lift my opponent over me like this. And okay, now I'll pick a side redirect my opponent away from that leg I want okay, and find a connection with the single X. Okay, so again, finding a single X. Okay. Now, many times we won't be able to get to the inside of our opponent's elbows. Either he's gonna keep the elbows down or he's not gonna let a, allow us to hold the hands. So we're gonna play basically with what our opponent is gonna give us. So if he wants to keep the hands to the outside, okay, and kind of hide the hands out, we're gonna to go to the two lapels. Okay, this is, again, you see something that uh, Marcelo uses quite a bit and uh, has taught a lot at the academy over the years. So I'm going to go straight to the, the, the lapels if his elbows are tight and he's bringing the hands to the outside. Okay, if he wants to defend the lapels by bringing his hands to the inside and keep the elbows tight, we're going to go to the triceps. Okay, if he wants to use the hands to engage with me to stop that, I'm going to be able to get inside. Okay, so we should basically always be able to connect with something here okay so in this instance he's gonna he's gonna pull his arms back and away he's gonna expose the lapels so we're gonna scoot and find the single leg x position one thing that's nice about the lapel grips is we can kind of give our opponent a little bit of direction as well as we're entering we kind of guide them to where we want so we can push their head uh initially away from us a bit easier um, to expose the leg we want, okay? And if my opponent wants to hide the lapels and keep the elbows tight, we're gonna go to the triceps and again, scoot it and finding a single leg accent tree. Okay, so we can, uh, again, use our hooks to elevate our opponent with an upper body control to expose the legs and from there attach with single leg X.